Hello everybody, this is Mustang Blue, but coming at you with a, another Let's Play. This time, we're going to be going into what I assume is the end of the main story of Monster Sanctuary. I'm sure there's not much left now. Alright, because of course I have to go up here. Ice, maybe. I think it's ice. Um, somebody that was ice, I'm sure. Right. <laughs> Where the heck's the ice ball bat? There he is. I, was, I knew, I was like, I know there's some, some creature in this game has ice. Very nice. Can't really complain about getting that. I think I'm actually using that on somebody. And they use a gauntlet. And just, you know, the staff. You do have assess this plus five. Plus five items aren't easy to come by, but it is um, always nice to have more. So let's just um, go back to our old way of doing things, shall we? They go stolen all my stuff. Probably change my ultimates um, to better fit my playstyle again now that um, we're done with that boss fight. I'm pretty sure we could have almost killed them first try. I'm not gonna say literally. Um, first turn, but maybe that like second turn, possibly. If we had the right ultimates. At least that's what I want to believe. So. Did you blizzard? Nice storm. Is 260% damage, 50% chance for chill. This is 300, so it's 20%. This is barely better. I stole my honestly, it's not much of an ultimate, but this chill chance is worse too, though. So. I think Frost Pierce is going to be better just because of the massive damage it does. With like the crit damage, I mean to say. Somebody around here better activate Earth Orb, I'm sure. Let me see, we're getting some really good items. We're basically just activating random orbs. <laughs> like sometimes you have to do like genuine puzzles and stuff to get items that are worse than this. That's it, they're just coming for me. Alright, so shield. 
Blizzard. Do Ice Spears. That's not good. Fortress. Ice Storm. Just keep using Ice Spear of Holy to hit everybody. Too big of a deal. I think we got him. Thanks, still only got four stars. Or well, what happens when we get XP caps in anything special? It's like your max level, but you're still earning XP. I'm assuming that is finally these hidden platforms I have heard so much about. Ow. I'm bad. I should have like an apple in it or something. A restoring wood. Wand. Ooh, that's actually a pretty nice one. Oh, I forgot. Speaking of food, I always forget to feed my people. The fight would have probably been... It's the boss would have probably been a little bit easier if I had remembered to just feed people. Right, so who needs food? Mango. About as good as it gets for mana for us right now. Crit damage. You have about as good as it gets for that. Um. Okay, you can have some mangoes. I have like an almond to help you not die. Alright, let me go back in here and we can get back on the move again. Hopefully, not die horribly to whatever the final boss is. And this all assuming we find the final boss this episode. I'm assuming we will, but I am far from positive. Overall, not too bad. Get fortress up. Keep dropping an ice spear volley on him. And then with our shield, there's no way they're gonna actually hurt us. stabs because they're both they're a little bit uneven on health now so that'll probably help even it out yep there we go five stars finally i'm pretty positive i do not have a light shifted version of one of you guys i got dark shifted one though You a pretty good nose, huh? I can sense other familiars. I can sense that their thoughts are as clouded as if they've been numbed. You've taken away their free will. 
can have them running away, can we? Not after I won them fair and square. That's disgusting. We're not prizes for you to win. You don't deserve to own us just because you defeated our keepers. Keepers of old must have thought differently then. What are you talking about? The first monster keepers are the ones who created this magic allowing to take over a monster to a keeper duel. I just revived an old tradition is all. I was some alchemy, of course, to be able to mask my bloodline and still the familiars of other families. I can't even remember anything about this tradition, so it must have been abolished several centuries ago. Pa, typical of you to act so high and mighty, just like all monster keepers. This mask you call civilization is nothing but a tool for the weak to take what belongs to the strong. Just as I was robbed of the spectral familiar that I deserved, what I did was simply set the record straight. What you did was not rightful. Neither in the eyes of the monster keepers nor in the eyes of morality. You'll use any argument to vilify me because you fear not only me but also what I represent. What you represent is truly monstrous and barbaric. I can't stand hearing it any longer. We will challenge you to a duel of times. I've taken, taken the words out of my mouth and I have another formula in our collection. Oh. Alright, so hopefully he's not as much of a literal monster as the last guy was. You got told the spectral familiars in the background there. Um, so I'm thinking we go like this, just to test the water. As it were, Get in with a strong blizzard. I'm not expecting to win. But he's not putting on any hills, so he's not countering my uh, debuff strat. I mean, not my debuff strats, but my... Oh, he did put on some chills on me, which is going to make it a little bit more difficult for me to apply shields efficiently, which is not good. Yeah, if he doesn't have a bunch of regens like last time, then we should be able to fight this like any normal fight. Their chills are definitely making it difficult. Hmm. So he might honestly just chill me to the point where I can't um, do anything. Should be the same though, because he has a bunch of chills on him too. Right, you're borderline useless, so we basically have to switch you out. Oh, he restored the chills. Crap. This is absolutely uh, bad for us. Helping hand for now.
I gotta keep healing you with helping hand. Well, we're struggling to break through now, but it's not for the same reasons as it was before. It's because that we just can't do enough damage. I think we forfeit here. And then we um, change out our ultimates. I'm not liking this blizzard, so I'm going to go back to Typhoon Cut and send you back to Lava Stream. That's pretty far back. we need to focus on. He's chilling the crap out of us. I think we can kind of handle that. What we want to do do that. Then we'll apply an ice storm on everybody so we can get chill on them. He's gonna buff him like crazy. Yeah, the spirit's the one that showed us, it looks like. But we have nothing that gives us mana of any kind. Ah, oh, we're in a bad spot. <laughs> Not gonna be enough, we just have to keep Find more and more chill to them. Go for the best there. And lava stream on you. Let's have to focus him. Focusing you down. Almost got him. Hit him with life wave. One, we traded one for one so far. As long as you just keep doing life wave, we'll be good. All right, the frog is also weak to um, fire. So we'll just keep, keep on going then.
Seems like we're able to mostly heal through them. Put your frogs down. Finally pop out a fortress. Life wave is weakening, which is not good, but fortress is here to help. Right, so we're targeting you, because I'm pretty sure you're the one who is chilling the crap out of us. And those chills need to calm down. Mega, uh, Mega Rock. Meter Rock Shower sucks here, so instead we're just gonna use Forge. And you're gonna need to use Full Hill on him. Keep his little butt alive. And then just Toxic Slam him, and then that should hopefully stop all the chill from happening. Alright, good. So now we're not ridiculously debuffed. already not looking good. <laughs> right, so I'm thinking we target the bird. Toxic Sam almost one shot him. Alright, it did one shot him, but they revived. Crap. Alright, the debuffs weren't enough to stop him. It's very important what they choose to do. Holy crap, we came so close to winning. Alright. Got one more fight left in this episode. Sure, not going to be as tough as last time. <laughs> Just need to be um, a little bit more on the careful side. Target you first. See if we can't get rid of you and get rid of the huge chill damage that you do right out the gate. It won't stop the chills from happening, but it can potentially stop um, the damage from it. I think you're the one that's damaging us with chills, anyways. Course, we want to return it in kind and damage you guys as many kills as possible. Shield is definitely giving us trouble. 
getting quite a run for our money because of that shield he has on. There we go, he's dead. Our frog is next. bad spot so I'm actually just gonna have you heal yourself I'm gonna hit you with a lava stream yep and I did amazing work on you Very soon. I think the lion comes out next after the frog. We'll do this just so we can get um, everybody healed up with good buffs on. Lions next. I'm not super duper worried about the um, spectral eagle. I think it was coming out. Hit you with a lava stream. Good, good. I think we lost here, but... I don't think it was by landslide, though. Taking you out is not a um, super easy task. Maybe if we split the difference in the first fight and um, have Lycan target the front runner and then Finlay target the back guy, we might both take them both out. They don't seem to have that much health, but anyways, so we're going to end this episode for today. Until next time, this has been Watson Loba signing off, and I hope I'll see you all soon. Until then, hope you have a wonderful day. Goodbye.